I don't know if you can see this, this viewfinder's bad, but these chemtrails today, my friends just phoned me up. They've chemtrailed right along Brighton seafront. Now, if I just get underneath that cloud, there should be in my view a live one going down now. It could be a con, could be a contrail. There's plenty of little jets going over that aren't leaving them, but there's plenty that are leaving shitloads of chemtrails right the way across Brighton Seafront. fresh one coming right over my head. Thanks. Okay YouTubers, uh, there's another little commercial jet up there, exactly the same altitude and uh, nothing whatsoever coming out of the back of it and it's the same height as all the other trails and it's just crossing a trail path now for another jet which is going up leaving a trail up this way but that these are dispersing quite quick but the big heavy ones from earlier are all still there right across the sky up to the north where they stop but these particular ones are northwest northwest of brighton and the whole of the seafront was clear blue sky, it got completely chemtrailed and now it's a cloud base. It's completely covered in uh, a thick wall of clouds, which I'll show you right now. There's the cloud base right across the seafront that wasn't there earlier. And you can see further down towards Peace Station and that is clear, fluffy clouds. And uh, so there we go. And these babies have been there a long time, a good hour and a half. I was chatting to all the golfers, they're saying, oh, did you get our shot? It's like, no lads, I'm filming those chemtrails. Well, what are they? Oh, uh, they're just sort of dropping chemicals on us, you know. And I said they cause fibromyalgia, more gallons this, that, the other. The guy goes, oh, I've suffered with all that. I said, oh, do you come out and play a lot of golf? Under the chem. See, look, there's a plane going right. There's another low level one. And all these low level ones that I've been looking at, they're not leaving any of these chemtrails but there are a lot that are. And, you know, higher up, commercial jet, I can see, you probably can't see it. It's really sunny, it's hard to see. What, I can't see anything in the viewfinder, apart from my own ugly mug. But all these little commercial jets, they're just leaving proper, you know, vapor trail, contrail, dissipates immediately within sort of 20 seconds. Some of them, like, there's a sort of big diagonally one that's going up here. I know it's hard to see, you probably can't see it. Uh, that's dissipating quite quick but it's still left quite a bit of crap behind it so there you go for now right here's a good here's an example of a normal plane with a normal contrail yeah this is normal this is normal And that is very abnormal. I've been up here an hour now. And these main ones haven't gone anywhere. But 
Whoops. Oh, I'm fully zoomed out. Actually, I can see a new fresh one going down out to the north side. You probably won't see that. I've even tried with my Panasonic camera today, but in this bright sunshine, it's so hard with the viewfinder. This is what my friend was saying. He was trying to capture some down on the seafront, and uh, it's all done in line of the sun, and it just glares. It's very hard, so we've got to get some trick photography, learn how to filter the sun out somehow, get a filter lens or something. Yeah, old people, Brighton. You're being fucking chemtrailed, man. Like, heavy. Masses of this shit. Just on the left of that light, you see that crisscross. So I'm using one hand, I'm being lazy. <laughs> Have a fresh one. See a fresh one being laid across some old ones. <laughs> 